people what up africa what up lagos you're tuning to one race tv exclusive my name is ve to the r to the se1 you can call me verse one just it's, it's that simple that short and that brief to tune in to this tv to get fun and catch up with all the excitement we're bringing straight to you we are at don't do be entertainment and we are here to catch one of nigeria's biggest largest one of the early starters of productions in africa in Lagos, Nigeria. This is first start. This is Lagos City, and we're here at, at Don Zubi Entertainment to meet uh, Nelson Brown. And of course, the main man you should know, and that you should know, I'm talking about NG. And we are here to catch them really, really on our way. They don't know. Come along. Come along. See how this goes. I'm not really expecting this. And oh, this is more like a car. Whoa, this is more like a big cash. You can imagine. Angie, what up, people? I'm cool, brother. What up? How are we doing? I'm fine, man. God! What is happening? Who are you with in the car? Yeah, wow! I'm in. Whoa! I'm in. Interesting! Nelson Brown. Good afternoon, sir. Ah, are we, are we going to do it like the Africans? Yeah, like Africans do it. Oh. We go down like this. <laughs> so we go to the valley. Not necessary. Not necessary. <laughs> okay. So, um, you are here today. You, this is our Don Zubi Entertainment and what are you? What are you people up to today? Yeah, we we want to do a song for NG. Yeah, song for, for for his mom. You Whoa! Know, just learned that he, he lost his mom. Okay. And this is tribute song that he wants to do for his mom. So that's what we hear. Wow, interesting. Engine, you lost your mom? Did you know? I didn't get this. Yeah, I lost my mom. It just happened. It just happened. I lost her. You know, my precious mother. It just oh. happened. You know, unexpectedly. Wow. It was a big shock to me, you know. Whenever I thought of I'm going to be losing my mom, you know, so soon. Yeah, that's why I'm here to be able to work with Nessie Brown to do a special song for her. I am extremely, extremely, deeply sorry about that. We didn't know about that. Okay, uh, people, you're still locked in and you're tuning for fun. Like I said, excitement and really, really, we're, we're going on today for unawares. Okay, we're catching them unawares. See your boy V to the R to the SE1, and this is the One Race TV exclusive. Okay, let's go check. Let's go see what you, what you all guys right, got. Right, what's okay. happening. Let's yeah, go. no problem. Oh no, okay. Friday night. It's Friday night. It's Friday night. No, no. no, no. I want to see you all dance. Uh, so we're the music, you understand? Yeah. 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 Everything that we you're hearing about NG, we're all done here. Yeah. Wow, we make the business of the song here. Yeah, yeah. Let's say this is more like the slaughter ground musically. Play, play this, is, this, is the, this is the killer ground. This yeah. is where you play, where you kill everything. Of course. Tell so us about I'm, about yourself. Well, well, I've been in the business for, for close to two decades now. Produce a lot of great artists, cover so many young talents in this country, and um, I'm happy to be working with NG and. Um, that's so far what I can say. I like you, you all know I'm in Nigeria and I'm a good music producer. Yes, we all know him. That is Nelson Brown and um, Angie. I I quickly want to know about you. I want to talk about you first. Now, Angie, the name it sounds big. It sounds very very different. And where did you get the name from? And what's the meaning? Angie. Angie. Angie is just a name. My name. My real name, as in, I would say is an abbreviation, right? From the spellings of my name. So, Angie means Ngozi. When you say Angie, O Z I, it means Ngozi. And Ngozi means, as in translation of Ngozi, means blessing. 
mean I'm blessed. All right, that's the meaning of my name, and that's the reason why I'm bearing that name, NG. Still, still, my name. All right. Okay. Just before we get back to Nelson Brown, we're still hanging. We're still hanging right here with NG, and um, of course. You're going to the slaughter room? Yeah, of course. Okay, that means I'll co I have to come back and meet you in the slaughter room the where you do all your slaughtering and you know the slaughters I mean. Okay. The normal slaughters, oh please, people, please don't get it twisted. I'm talking about the normal slaughter <laughs> for what it does. I'll, I'll come back to you, uh, Mr. Nelson Brown. So, am I permitted? Can I go in? Yes, because I see you know, you're, you're, you're so much in a hurry to go <laughs> kill it. To go <laughs> kill it. You can go do what you do while I hang out with NG. Now, Angie, for uh, how long have you been in the industry and what has this, what has the industry been like for you? Yeah, I would say professionally I've been in the industry for five good years now. Wow. And uh, since then, I thank God, there's been a whole lot of, you know, success, mm. you know, here and here. You know, I try to like, you know, bring more and more hits into the music industry and I thank God for God keeping me on and on. I mean, also not easy, guy. Ah, not not easy, uh, not, so easy <laughs> not easy at all. Not easy at But that's but that's what they keep saying. Yeah. It's not easy. Not it's easy. not easy. Every day we see them with the big swags. We see them with the <laughs> big yeah. So thank God that thank God for for the fact that we have a uh, One Race TV exclusive. Yeah. Uh, being organized by One Race Concept dot com anyway. And you tell us more about yourself, the music uh, industry. How has it been like for you? Yeah, I would say the music industry has been a lot of old success, and as I said earlier on. You know, a whole lot of the Amphon and ja, my country, you know, you don't grow, it has grown big and grown large. You know, the world yeah. today will organize our music industry today. The whole thing would do the lives of Two Face, Debang, Asha, you know, whoever, Whiskey, and whoever, everybody. Mm. You know, it's going well, and I like it because you can find out as from the year, I mean, seven years ago or eight years ago, it wasn't like this today. Yes. You get it? Yes. Well, Tango today is, is being, you know, a huge success in Nigeria. Mm. As in the world today, one like mm. Krabos. Mm. They want to invite us there in Africa. When you go to the city, they, they want to invite two, uh, the, the Peace Squares on the show. Wow. You know, they you know, don't like me. I thank God, like, I'll be going down to Europe, coming up, you know, next month, man, you know, wow. my tour. Wow. You know, they can imagine that we Nigerian artists okay. being well recognized out there in Europe as in the world generally. Okay, and you know, in Nigeria, what's your music like? Yeah, what's my music, music? Uh, for example, it's dance hall kind of a high life. Dance hall? Yeah, dance hall high life. Um, NG, how do you relate with your female fans? Yeah, I relate with them very well. Yeah. Okay. Are you married? Um, no, 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 I'm not married. One of your, you know, one of your most outstanding you know, superseding show. Now, uh, oh gosh. One of your like best. I say, yeah, one of my best is I think um, is when I went to uh, Malaysia to get my award. Yeah, Malaysia. When I was in Malaysia to okay. get my award, my, uh, you know, first European award that I got in mm. the first uh, abroad award. Talking about the music internationally, where did you see Nigeria, uh, the Nigerian music industry, you know, where did you see it heading? Where do you think it's going through? Uh, Especially with your class, your type of music, and uh, where, where do you see yourself in internationally? Yeah. Few years from now. Uh, internationally, few years from now, I think uh, if you're going to continue holding on with the originality, you know, the originality, yeah, originality, so keep doing what we have as our own. Uh, now, I want to tell us three things about yourself. Tell me one thing you can never do. One thing you will never do. One thing that I will never do is to, uh, you know, cheer for women be like me. The next one. What is that thing you can do, okay, that you want to do, but you you can do it for yourself, for yourself alone, but not for anybody else, not to anybody, no matter what? Uh, yes, uh, what I can do for myself, I think um, I can only make sure that I, I, I look healthy. Something new? Yeah. yeah. What, what are you working on right now? You got something new, like right now? Yeah, I got something new. Do you want to see that? See, I want to feel it. I just don't want to. I want, want to touch it. You want to touch it? I want to touch it. All right, follow yes. me down to the studio. Okay. okay. He just yeah. said it. Let's let's go find out. Come. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Whoa! Yeah, what we got here? Who do we got here? Yeah. For Angie, on your master, you know what's up? I'm hanging out with that swan on One Race TV exclusive. You know what's up? It's coming out to blow your mind with a whole lot of artists on the TV on audio. My brother, keep watching it. All right, it's One Race TV. Hey, go on your net to go see it more and more. One Race, one love, yo man.